Hello everyone. In this tutorial video, I will demonstrate how to create complex cylindrical shapes in Maya using the duplicate special with transform option. This concept applies to various 3D applications, although tool names may differ. When dealing with highly detailed models, more geometry might be necessary. Let's go through the process of creating these shapes step by step. Start by creating the base shape of the cylinder. I used 64 divisions to capture details and then adjusted the values accordingly. Insert supportive loops to sculpt the desired shape. Initially, focus on creating the primary shape. Later, we'll duplicate and transform it. To achieve an 8-segmented cylinder, I extracted 8 faces from the 64, each representing a segment. Employ supportive loops to refine the fence-like details. Use the extrusion tool to define the shape further. Separate the selected faces to form a distinct object. Move the pivot to the center of the world axis. Access Edit Duplicate Special Options. For rotational calculations, calculate the angle, 360 degrees divided by 8 segments equals 45 degrees. Rotate around the y-axis by 45 degrees. Set the number of copies to 7. Merge all the components and vertices with minimal distance to consolidate the shape. Now, moving on to the second shape. Similarly, separate the top and bottom portions of the cylinder. Follow the earlier steps for shape creation.
employ chamfer vertex to round the shape. Adjust and connect the vertices to achieve the desired outcome. Apply extrusion and bevel operations for further refinement. Repeat the rotational calculation for this shape as well. Three hundred and sixty degrees divided by eight segments equals forty five degrees for rotation around the y axis. Seven copies should be generated. Combine both the first and second shapes by merging the vertices meticulously. Now, let's proceed to the top and bottom shapes using cylinder cap. Follow the outline steps for shape creation. If any tools malfunction, reset them.
Utilize the bevel tool to define the shape, changing the miltering option to uniform. Repeat the rotational calculation for these shapes. 360 degrees divided by 8 segments equals 45 degrees for rotation around the y-axis. 7 copies should be generated. Merge all components and vertices with minimal distance for a seamless appearance. Enhance the output with additional details and combine all shapes. For the bottom shapes, extra detailing is applied. Only four selected faces are used for generating these shapes. Finally, follow the same process for the fourth shape. Use the rotational calculation. 360 degrees divided by 16 segments equals 22.5 degrees for rotation around the y-axis. 15 copies should be generated. Combine and merge all vertices with minimal distance.
This method provides a simplified approach to creating complex cylinder shapes. Thanks for watching Happy Modeling.